Hello, everybody, and thank you for joining us. This is Yoel Cortex, Senior Librarian at Ex Libris, and today we're discussing a new development for the August 2022 release, whereby the Alma Digital Universal Viewer now supports the display of non-image files, for example, PDFs, videos, uh, MP4s as videos, audio files, uh, for those interested on a technical level behind the scenes, there was a major upgrade to the IIIF framework, as well as to the Presentation API version 3. That's just for technical matters for those interested. And now an institution can use the Universal Viewer to display both images and non-images using one viewer, the Universal Viewer. Let's jump right in and see what we're talking about. So I'm in the configuration menu right now, and let's take a look at the viewer services here under Discovery Interface Display Logic. We'll pop into the viewer services. You can see I've got the Universal Viewer as well as the Alma Viewer both activated. And if I come into the Universal Viewer, First of all, I've got a clear indication here in the description because soon we're going to have an option to use the Universal Viewer or the Alma Viewer, and I want to point out that we're using the Universal Viewer. So clearly it's displaying here. And we have a service availability rule called Image Files, MP4, and PDF. And if we take a look at that, we'll see that it's using a regular expression to say the suffix of the file can be TIFF, JP2, JPEG, MP4, or PDF. That's not exactly our topic on how to make the expression here, but suffice to say that the Universal Viewer is defined to be able to display, among others, an MP4 and a PDF. And when the file does equal one of those suffixes, the display is true. We also have the Alma Viewer, which we won't be viewing, but we want to show that it will display uh, because also we have a service availability rule, which is the default here with no conditions and true. So any type of file uh, will, will bring about the option to view it via the Alma Viewer as well. So we've got the Alma Viewer and the Universal Viewer both activated, and we've got them clearly labeled. Then we have two examples here. First example we'll look at is A Lady in the Tower, The Fall of In Boleyn. Let's take a look at the representation there. And we have a file list with a PDF. Then we have another one, Lake, Wind, Trees, and Ducks. And here, let's also look at the representation. And here we have an MP4. So we should be able to view the files of both of these examples using the Universal Viewer. Let's take a look. Let's start with Lake Wind Trees and Ducks. Let's do a view it. Now I'm doing the view it here within Alma. It emulates the same exact view it as a user gets in Primo V Discovery uh, or any discovery using the view it. And here we have the Universal Viewer, and we have the Alma Viewer, labeled as we had in our service description. Let's take a look at the Universal Viewer on this MP4. We'll click Play, and there we go. The video is showing with sound in the Universal Viewer MP4. Let's take a look at the other example. Okay, and let's take a look here as well. View it. Again, we have the Universal Viewer and the Alma Viewer. We'll do the Universal Viewer, and here's our PDF. So we were able to view the PDF and the MP4 in the Universal Viewer, something we couldn't do before the August 2022 release. We thank everybody for joining us and have a nice day.